Parker School, every morning you hear us say the pledge, but some of you may not know, what does that mean? What's that all about? So we are going to share with you today what we want you to know about our positive behavior intervention and supports program here at Parker School. We have a fabulous PBIS team. So I'd like my team members to raise their hand, wave at the crowd. We have Mr. Parsley, who happens to be in a meeting, but he's our school psychologist. Ms. Jones, our school counselor. Ms. Chaffee. Okay, Ms. Chaffee, she's operating the equipment, okay. Mr. Pennant, our school social worker. Ms. Fletcher, who does everything for us. Ms. Smith, our K-1 teacher. Ms. Herbert, our fabulous, phenomenal lunch founder, thank you. And Ms. Wright is also on our team, but she is not able to join us this morning. So the team is gonna come before you and share a lot of good stuff, and we wanna get you pumped up because when we give out those rewards every month, we want the number to get bigger and bigger and bigger. So you have to earn those tallies. You have to show us good conduct. You have to always prove that you're doing the right thing so that at the end of the month, when we're doing that ice cream party or whatever, your name is gonna be called. So sit back, relax, and give us that Parker Tiger behavior. I'm going to bring the team on now. Good morning, Parker Tigers! Good morning! I'm glad to see all of you. Are you excited? Yeah! Yes, we're all ready. Okay, we're going to begin this challenge. It's called the Positive Behavior Intervention Services Challenge. Okay, it's also called the Auditorium Challenge. So we're going to ask that Chanel from Miss Choppy's class comes up. Charnel. Thank you, Charnel, right here. Okay, thank you, Charnel, for being so brave to do this. Okay, so this is an auditorium challenge, and this time we're going to ask that all of you, the boys and girls, that we listen and we sit back against your chairs with your legs in front of you. Yes, with your legs in front of you, and we're going to have we're going to remain silent for one whole minute. Can everyone do that? Yeah. Can everyone take on that challenge? Yeah. Okay, look to the person next to you to make sure. Are they sitting up straight? Yeah. Are they listening? Yeah. Are their feet in front of them? and 
visualize behavior planning. Who here has ever seen the pause or received pause? Yes. So we want to encourage positive behavior. Have you been behaving and acting and behaving appropriately in school? So October is National Bullying Month. I, t I know, some of you are scratching your head, what does that mean? So bullying, as we all know, I know everybody knows bullying is not a good thing. So when we say October is National Bullying Month, that means that we are acknowledging bullying is a bad thing. It means that we are standing up and we are speaking out when we see our friends, classmates getting bullied, or when we ourselves are getting bullied, we're always going to tell somebody. Okay, we're going to stand up. We're not going to just sit back and let it continue. We are going to stand up and we recognize what bullying is. Okay, so I'm going to quickly go around. I just want to ask does, can anybody tell me? What bullying is? Uh, Amir, Amir, right here. Bullying is That's partially it. Can you tell me what it is? Okay. Um, I think I see Tristan Jackson over with his hand up. What is bullying, Tristan? Okay. Uh, what is bullying? Uh-huh, yes, when people are doing things to you that you don't like, then them? That's right, when you're, when you're doing something that is unkind to someone, um, over in the pink shirt, Very good. That was a very, very good definition. All right, wait. Okay, guys. So, bullying is when one person harms or hurts another person, usually through intimidation. Okay? Usually it's when someone is being aggressive towards someone else, physically or verbally, and they're doing this to hurt someone's feelings, and, but the main thing is using power to their advantage, okay? So, quickly, an example, and this is, as I said before, this is inappropriate behavior. This is something that we want to recognize as inappropriate, and we want to work on it in our school, okay? If I am bigger than Ms. Jones, and I am 
telling her, you know, I'm going to take her lunch money or I'm going to beat her up or something like that, that is bullying. That is not nice. That's inappropriate behavior. Okay? So, another question. What are some bad things that can happen as a result of one person bullying another person? Uh, is that Kyle back there, Kyle? Okay. <laughs> one bad thing that can happen when someone bullies another person. Okay, a bad thing that can happen because of bullying. Someone can get hurt, yes. One bad thing that can happen because of bullying. That's right, it's annoying, yes. One thing that can happen because of bullying. Okay, that's one thing that someone could do. And last one. Good start. 
Mrs. Fletcher. Thank you. 
Mr. P, Mr. Parsley. I'm a school psychologist and I'll be the coach here at PBIS. So we want to leave with one more challenge, and this one's a lot of fun because of what you can earn if you do it correctly. Once you are called by your teacher, we are to leave our auditorium silently and return to class. If we do this, we all earn a reward come next week. Does that sound good to everyone? Yeah! Okay. okay, guys. We have one more thing for staff. The matrixes should be posted in every room, and if you don't have one, please see myself or Ms. Jones, and we will give them to you. Um, otherwise, you guys have been fantastic, and thank you guys for quieting down and sitting like great students. We, we would like to dismiss. Okay, I would like to everybody, let's give her a round of applause for our PBIS team. What a great assembly. So, to conclude, Mr. Parsley made a great point in the way we exit, the way we enter the auditorium, the way we exit and enter the cafeteria, when we're walking through the building, remember, you should be respectful, quiet, silent passing, okay? When someone's speaking to you, you should be looking up at the person talking and not being disrespectful and looking and hitting someone else, okay? So we had a great assembly and some fabulous celebration of activities that we're going to have throughout the month. And if you earn, Miss Jones, raise those paws. If you earn those paws, you will be celebrating a lot this year. So at this current time, let's watch and see how we handle ourselves throughout the day. And starting with right now, we are going to exit the auditorium in a respectful manner, starting with our older classes. So at this point, sixth grade, please quietly exit the auditorium. And while we're waiting, everybody is sitting perfectly right now. And we are looking to see who will be getting that award for next week. Thank you. Great job, PBIS team. Thank